This is a summary of the structure of the Milky Way. While we have never traveled outside our own galaxy to take a look at it, we have clues from observations at multiple wavelengths of the electromagnetic spectrum. We can also compare with other known spiral galaxies. In a top-down view, the Milky Way galaxy would have an elongated central bulge of a mix of stars. It will be dominated by a yellowish glow. Spiral arms wrap around this bulge. The spiral arms are dominated by the brightest of stars, which are blue giants. We also observe star-forming regions as well as dark dust. The gap between spiral arms is not empty. There are stars in between the spiral arms as well. They are just not as bright. Viewed edge on, the galaxy resembles a disk. The bulge is wider than the rest of the plane of the galaxy. In the disk are found the gaseous star forming regions that then form open clusters. Surrounding the disk is the halo of the galaxy. Halo in this context just means anything still within the sphere of influence of our galaxy. The halo is mostly empty of stars and star forming regions, with the exception of globular clusters, as well as satellite galaxies, such as the small Magellanic clouds. It has been discovered that luminous matter Matter that can be observed at various wavelengths in the electromagnetic spectrum is just a small part of our galaxy. The majority of the mass of our galaxy is made of dark matter. We don't know what dark matter really is, but there are some hypotheses. The leading hypotheses are machos, massive compact halo objects, and wimps, weakly interacting massive particles. Not all galaxies are the same. Ours is a spiral galaxy. There are other types as well.